Hello girls, how are you doing? Let's do another pick a corner. Today is going to be what would they like you to do? Could be triggering. Uh, let's uh, let's go with the flow today, okay? Well, we always go with the flow anyway, but let's go particularly with the flow today. One, two, one, two. Part number one, what would they like you to do? Six of Cups, Queen of Swords and the Year of Fan. Well, I think um, you probably present yourself as a queen of soul by now so you make a decision a conscious decision enough is enough i'm not having this anymore so be it so you give a lot of chances and maybe what they would like you to do is to give another chance but i think you got to the point where enough is enough so yes you do have an idea of romantic love here for sure but we cannot just leave with love and just uh, living on uh, some kind of like, I don't know, some kind of cloud. Uh, no, reality check here. It's someone you already know, someone you give a lot of chances, someone with who you share a lot of emotion and feelings, but also share some kind of situation where you had to learn, you had to grow. This person told you a lot about yourself and you probably did the same for them. But they would like you to maybe show maybe more soft energy, kind energy when you're not having this because you know obviously clearly what you want and what you don't want. And maybe what you've been learning all, all along is to actually reconnect with that uh, understanding of I am. I know my worth. I know what I can offer you. I know what I have to give to you, but not at any cost. And I am not going to compromise. So you may have had to learn some lesson, but I think what they would like you to do is to go back to the romantic version of you. I don't think you want that. I'm going to go for one more. Yes, I think, you know, they still want this. Oh, it was love. It was beautiful. It was so romantic. Yeah, but that person didn't do any work. If they haven't, um, how can I say, embrace the maybe therapy, embrace an, an in-depth knowledge of themselves. If they haven't done any work on themselves, that, that is not going to, you know, nothing is going to change because what they have is maybe depression to start with. They were maybe kind of unhappy with their own uh, life and they were hoping for you to come and transform everything, to make it all beautiful, to bring the love, okay? Yeah, but you, you know, you don't mind bringing the love, but you want to receive. And if you don't, at some point, you will say arrivederci, okay? So I think what they would like, and I think it's quite clear, and we're going to keep it simple anyway today, um, it's more love, another chance, uh, you to be more, I mean, understanding one more time. You can't be bothered anymore. I think you're trying very hard to understand them even more that they understand to understand themselves. Enough is enough. I don't know, you don't know how hard it was to let you go. Yes, that's why you decided. It was hard for you to be the Queen of Swords, Matthew Mel as a matter. You had to cut it off. And know it's like sometime when you have to remove the plaster, ugh, you know it's gonna hurt, but you're gonna have to do this because there's no other way. Bingo, okay? So that is a tough one. Creative potential. You are by, by nature infinitely creative. Life is sea of creative potential just waiting to be expressed through you. You are free to express all your heart desires. Yeah, I think you are free altogether. You have a creative potential and you want maybe to go and create something with someone else. I think you don't understand it. You come back to yourself. You know that uh, there's some things that you needed to understand and comprehend and maybe that's what you did. You learn. You learn to go back to you to create a life for yourself. And if that means that, means that you have to cut it off, so be it. Because what you want is a real, pure, romantic love. And I don't think you see that person as the final destination. I think you realize I have to cut you off. I ha it was hard because you really gave 100%. But you realize that you have to cut it off because you will never get what you want because he's not the right person. Uh, harsh, but uh, real. Okay. So part number two, what would they like you to do? The world. Ace of sword and the two of sword. Well, there's a lot of sword here, a lot of uh, mind. Well, what they would like you to do is to actually open a new cycle of life. They, ha they think very highly of you. They want you to know exactly what you want and what you don't want and maybe who you want. 
I think there is an idea of them accusing you not to have done the work, not to do introspection, to block your heart, to block your eyes. Uh, they think that we went through the ten of soul before that, so we know what we want now, what we don't want. We should be more prepared to go for it. Yeah, but maybe, uh, maybe they think the world of you, maybe you don't think the world of them out. Um, if you're hesitating between two, maybe it's because you're not really uh, finding the right person just yet. Let's have one more. Yeah, you see what I mean? We're still on the Ten of Swords here. We're not done yet. I think um, they want you to go there. Let me know where we want and what we don't want. We're clear now. Because I don't want to hurt anymore. I don't want to not be around you anymore. I don't want to see you... Uh, uh, with someone else and, and be suffering anymore. I want to stop the suffering. Yeah, but you know what? Until you get the memo, you're going to stay there. Mm -hmm. And then bingo. I think the fact that someone is not opening their heart, maybe someone is still uh, in between two. We still have to finish something. This is a new cycle of life, but we need to finish the previous one. And the previous one is still hurting. I think what they would like you to do is to accelerate the process. Okay, let's just, uh, let's go, let's go, let's just move forward. Mm -mm -mm. And I think when, I'm not saying you have to marinate in the Ten of Swords, but you have to make sure that you don't endorse it for real. And then you will actually know for real what you want, what you don't want. If you haven't made up your mind between two, it's because you know clear. You know, uh, it has to be clear cut. If you still like, yes, no, maybe this one, mm, I know. No, you haven't done the work. You haven't finished one cycle of life. You know, when the, the snake changed skin, uh, you're not going to drag half of it, of the old one with you. So you're going to have to go through the whole process and it's really giving birth to yourself and go through all of it, the Ten of Swords, ouch, and then bingo, right? Yes, of course. Some people, they just don't want to hurt. Oh, no, 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 no. I just want to have the lesson. But, you know, like I take a peel, I don't have to work hard on this. No, no, no. When if you, you have to learn. You have to go through the process, you know. Anyhow, uh, I wish things could be different. You bet. <laughs> That's for sure. And uh, they wish that you already knew, clear cut. Okay, we know where we're standing. Yes, it's a new cycle of life. Let's go on holiday day together. Yoo-hoo! Back to happy, happy, happy. No. Um, because maybe you don't want to be happy, happy with them. So, no, I think uh, too many people want to, oh yeah, want to learn uh, life, but without going through the hurdle. Mm. No, I'm going to work. I'm going to work at all. Adventure, here we go. <laughs> Instead of seeing the current situation as an obstacle, mm -hmm, try seeing it as an adventure explore all the possibilities there are many more than you currently imagine instead of seeing things as either black or white try to explore all the colors in between yes it cannot be either can you see uh it cannot be either this one or this one there's also a lot of different things a different nuance that you need to experience in life you know some people, they just want to create something like bing, bam, boom, they sort it. No, it takes time. We try, we try again. doesn't work or we fix. And some things have to take time. Why everything has to be urgent? Why everything has to go fast and furious? You know, a speed doesn't uh, give, you know, a, a reinsurance of quality. No. And actually, the things that take longer actually um are more expensive in life if you want a big big name for wine for example you're gonna have to wait but my goodness the value of that you know um wine would be remarkable so you give time to time too many people are in a rush too many people and particularly women they want to have things in in the calendar already no let life be okay please okay cannot do everything by like that by tomorrow 10 o'clock no no everything is like that i keep saying that anyhow on this do on the what <laughs> on this note i'm a beautiful day and i see you tomorrow Mwah. ciao